But we never really fully closed. We were kind of open to assist the hospital and frontline staff. So we opened up the 2nd of July just for room sales, kind of Wednesday to Sunday, kind of over kind of phased over reopening period, just kind of to see how we get on. Kind of we deep clean on the Monday and Tuesday. So that's why we said we closed for two days, just get everything deep cleaned. So trading hours, as I said, we, over, we only open on a Wednesday to Sunday, but trading the hotel operates 24 hours a day apart from that. The food operates from 12 and noon to 9 o'clock at night time. Basically for the next two months, it's kind of a challenging period that's coming up. September, October, November is going to be very challenging for everyone. But the locals, we kind of we take bookings are essential, and we're kind of getting through them because we have a vast space in the Shearwater, so we've kind of three different areas we use to spread people across safely. We kind of have no, we just operate the one menu across the two operations, so we have the one menu operating across the bar and the restaurant. Everyone's happy up, like everyone's down staff wise, everyone's two meters apart. We have visors, we give hand sanitizing stations to each guest as they come in. So everyone's happy. Like once people feel safe, they're generally happy and they enjoy their meal. Kind of we're going to play it by here. We're not sure kind of if we go back into lockdown, whether the corporates will travel kind of weddings and functions. Wise, I think we're looking at next March before they all come back. Bar we have Christmas booked in, but kind of weddings and large functions, I think it's going to be next March before we start into them. It's more kind of working kind of lean and mean for the next couple of months. We're happy to be back open. We're, we're kind of in the community. We would like to see the local people come back into the, our hotel and we hope to service for the next couple of years going forward. Hello, we've been open for the last two weeks. This is our, and we'll be just heading in for our third weekend open. So far, so good. Thursday to Sundays for the moment and as time goes on we may look at, look at it again and see we need to do more hours, less hours, and just see how things develop with COVID over the next, going through the autumn and that. Food menu, we'll go with the same menu all day, every day. It, it seems to be more what, it's, it's easier for us to, to manage and probably easier for the customer to manage as well. It's all table service, food and drink. We would ask the people to come in. When they, when they do come in, or we would ask them to actually pre-book a table if, if at all possible and when they do come in to, to sit at their tables and wait for just bear with us and wait for service at the table whether it would be drink or food we operate a walk-in service we would recommend that you book just in case the first weekend was was quite was was, was a learning experience for our customers and ourselves last weekend was a, was was a pickup on that the feedback seems to be very very positive so far no complaints yeah, the autumn maybe, we're nervous about it, but going forward, we hopefully things will, will pan out.